Hey, Scott Sager here with RTC TV4 with one of our uh, line crewmen. We're out here at the old county home where uh, they've been digging up the uh, wrought iron fence that uh, Bob Peterson has donated for the new park at the corner of 9th and Main. Evan, it looks like all the digging's been done. Yeah, that is correct. So uh, talk to me about how the day went. You guys just went along and had to pull out this 100-year-old uh, fence? Right, yeah, we uh, had the backhoe going, and after we got a hole dug, we just lifted it up with the line truck and hoisted her up and put her on the trailer. Fantastic. Well, just another great thing RTC doing for this community. We volunteered to come out here, take a crew for the day, and uh, pull this fence up so that we can make that park beautiful when it gets developed. So Evan, we want to say thanks for all you do for RTC. Hey, thank you. Pleasure working here. I told you we'd make you famous. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Hey, we're here with Ethan Boyer from RTC. Uh, Ethan, uh, you've been with us how long? I've been here since November. November, okay, very good. Well, we've had him out here on the line crew today. How'd it go getting this fence out? It went very smooth. Did it actually? Oh yeah. So that's been in the ground for a hundred years, so very good, very good. So the plan is we're gonna store this until they get the park done and then we're gonna put it up, right? Yep, it's going to the city barn for now. Okay. <laughs> Well, we want to thank you for all you're doing for RTC and for this community. Thank you. I told you I'd make you famous too, didn't I? Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> Thanks again. Okay, now we're uh, out here. We've got Roy Vandermark. We're, again, at the county home south of town on uh, Highway 25 where Bob Peterson has donated the uh, cast iron. Is it wrought iron? What is it, Roy? Uh, I think it's cast. Okay, cast iron fence. This fence is going to go up at the park. We're looking forward to that. Uh, hopefully, yet this year, they'll get the, some work done on that. Talk to us about uh, RTC's role. Did Bob Peterson contact us, or did we just throw our name out there to help? Uh, no, Bob uh, called us, plus Mark Shroff. Oh, yeah. I, I believe Mark's going to put the fence back in. Okay. And then, uh, so we came out today just to get it up out of the ground, and we're going to uh, take it in town and store it away. And, and hopefully, like you say, this summer, um, be able to put it up at the park. Well, very good. Now, for those of you who don't know, know, Roy has celebrated his 30th year at RTC. Yep. 30 years, one thing, one job. Uh, you loved every day of it, haven't you? It's not just one job. <laughs> Line crew job, service tech, went to Akron, do fiber the curb over there. So anyway, now I run the line crew plus uh, charge of the fleet. So it's been fun. Yeah, a little bit of variety helps those 30 years pass, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, excellent. Well, Again, Roy Vandermark out here working for you, member of RTC's valuable crew, doing the community good by helping out with this fence here today. Roy, we thank you for your time. Thank you. All right. All right, now we're with Bob Peterson. Bob's well-known uh, Talma is where you went to high school, right? right? right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, a lawyer here in town, a uh, wonderful citizen and a uh, pillar of this community who got this new park going in at 9th and Main. Bob heard about that and uh, we've got uh, some fencing that you've donated, correct? Yes, that's correct. My wife and I wanted to donate that. Excellent, excellent. So we're out here at the old county home just south of uh, town on 25. Now, the home was taken down when, Bob? In the 90s, 80s? Uh, I think it was in the 90s. 90s? Yes. Mm -hmm. And did you buy the property? Is that, or did you just buy the fencing through auction? What what happened there? Oh, no, we bought, we owned the ground. Okay, you bought the ground. Yes. Very good. So this fence, uh, it has to have some value. I think so. We never, uh, uh, people asked us to put a price on it. We never did, and gotcha. nobody ever offered. So. Gotcha. Very good. Well, it's a beautiful fence. We've shown you some B-roll of that. Um, so the plan, Bob, is RTC came out, volunteered their time to uh, take it out and store it. And then I hear Mark Shrope's going to be putting it in when they when they do the park. Is that correct? I think that's right. I would imagine that uh, RTC will be helping on that. Sure, I'm sure our guys will be over there. It's in our back lot anyways, so it's right there. Well, Bob just told me a very interesting thing that I hadn't realized. It's about the fence itself, so we wanted to share that with you. Bob, tell them what you just told me. Well, I'm not sure about the very early history, but the fence was located around the courthouse, okay. the second courthouse. Okay. Uh, and when that was uh, taken down and the present courthouse was erected, this uh, fence was moved to the county farm. No kidding. Very good. So, I mean, that's many years ago. 1895. 1895. So this fence in theory could be 150 years old. Yes. 
Yeah. Okay. Well, very good. Well, some interesting facts there around the old courthouse. I want to see if we can't find an old picture of that somewhere, if it exists. I've, I've got uh, one or two. Do you? Yes. Well, very yeah. good. Maybe you can share that, and we'll share that with our viewers. Okay. okay? All right. Well, again, citizens coming together, volunteering to make this community a better place. We both know that that uh, corner in 9th and Main, once that's cleaned up, it's really going to put a whole new perspective on downtown Rochester. Yes, it should. So, uh, it we should. appreciate all you do, my and friend. And we've talked to some other people, too, about donating some fence. Good, good. So yeah. we're going to have a nice, nice looking park there. Well, I think so. <laughs> good, very good. Bob Peterson, uh, thank you for all you do for this community, Bob. I really appreciate it. We all appreciate it. You're so, welcome. You're out welcome. here at the county home, I'm Scott Seger. I want to thank Chris Messersmith for doing some camera work for us and everybody from RTC who's uh, helping this community. Thanks so much.